guys, play Yoshi here, and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last time we went throughout the Fort Hateno, I believe that's what it's called, and uh, we kind of went through and see what's going on over there. We uh, continued into East Nakluda and finished off going to this shrine right here after being chased by the Koblenz on horses and Moblins wielding giant axes. So, you know, obviously we're in very, very comfortable territory here, going into parts 19 of Breath of the Wild. So, by the way, I'm here with my brother, Micah, today. Yeah, huh? Micah. He's going to be doing commentary with me as we go into parts 19 of the Legends of the Breath of the Wild. So, uh, yeah, now that we've activated this tower, let's continue on and see what's... Actually, I'm Wait in this one here. How about... How we activate the tower? Now we're like, now you're Sonic and I'm Tails. There. What? <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> what? I know. Oh, so I was uh, to uh, tell. Now, um, I did want to actually take oh. a second to look oh, at this, that, that just great. because um of like everything that we could see. Oh, hey, so a... <sighs> now, of course, now we have the map. So we do know exactly where, you know, the stuff is located and all that just So uh, that does seem to be an enemy camp right there. There's a forest going to the uh, village. There's a clear pathway that we should be going. Uh, but the thing is, is that we can't really go down here without a horse. And if we do go down here, we have some guys awaiting us in the forms of, uh, you know, moblins and you know, stuff. So, I mean, yeah, fun stuff. That didn't even do anything! How did that not do, like, anything? Like, did you see that, actually? That, like, did nothing. That actually did, like, nothing. Yeah. Okay, uh, actually, I do want that torch. Yeah. In front. Oh. I don't want that. That's a heavy item. Again, these heavy items are not very good, you know, so. Um, Who's that Courtney? Well, it's spikes. Of sure. course I was. Um. Mm -hmm. Take two baked apples, Your I guess. Wait. Oh, no, that's not doing as much as I uh, Okay, well, um, either way, it worked out for us, so, I mean, uh, alright, so, we have some dudes over here. Uh, we might as well take them out, you know, so, um, unless there's a way that we can sneak past them. Actually, I don't think there's a way to sneak past them here, because if we do try to get past them, we have some guys waiting on horses over there. So, um... Can you just shoot them with yeah, the arrows? Yeah, yeah, hold on. Um... We'll switch my arrows to the regular arrows. Well, shoot. It's not a good time to miss. Uh, but hopefully these guys won't be able to catch up to us and... Um... <laughs> the guy just seriously, like, suplexed the dude and, like, threw him at us. That's actually funny. Oh my gosh. This guy is uh, evil. You boys, it comes. Uh, okay, well, we do obviously. This is just so comedic, though. It's funny. It's like something you'd see in Wind Waker. You know? It's like they perfectly merged Skyward Sword, Twilight Princess, and Wind Waker in this one game. I love it. But, um. Yeah, let's just shoot the sky a few more times. Yep, there we go. That guy's dead. Okay, I think you have to see that. Oh, okay. Now that guy's coming towards us. Yeah, I told you. Uh, that'll be like two hits, or it could just be a spin attack. That works too. Uh, Bubble like club, kind of unnecessary. Um, yeah, I think I think that's all. I I remember there was some dudes on a horse that we saw earlier, and um, not really seeing those dudes, but who knows? Maybe we'll see them later. Maybe it's, sometimes it's better if we don't have those guys. You know, just... Maybe it's a better time to see if, what they're up to. See if they're like sneaking. Uh -huh. Yeah, I can't really take the items while I'm mounted on a horse, can I? Uh, those are all arrows, aren't they? Wow. So I do get all of my arrows. Then. And you also get all of those. Stuff. Okay, well. If you, if you well, now it's raining. I mean, all that really matters is for, like, climbing and stuff. And, oh no, my guardian's so bug. Well, I guess the Bacoblin arm would be alright then. I mean, it's not like. It's overly necessary. Okay, no, his just... head is like... Okay, where was that guy's head too? Okay. Now, now he's dead? I think I'm he... so confused as to how this works, but, you know, whatever. I think, um, but, like, his head is so weak. Um, it's like as weak as, like, Undertale's heart. 
which gets Undertale's heart. It's a great conclusion to make, because, you know, Undertale's heart, or soul, is, I believe, what you're trying to talk about. Yeah, you know? but, like, when you it's get kind of hit by, like, Dependent a, on the player. It's like when you get hit by, like, a gift. A gift. A gift? Yeah. There is some force oh, around here. Cool. I'm not sure if it's, well, of course I'm going to want to explore that eventually, but the question is, you know, is that a necessary thing right now, you know? Oh. And it's raining and everything. I uh, don't like that. Uh, there is a sign right here. Let's go. Right. Let's see what's what that has to inform us of. I'm sure that will be a that those guys will be alerted to our presence once we get closer. So. Um, Lashlow Hobble. Okay, so it seems to be another branching path, but we don't. Quite want to go there just yet, and there's a lot of guys, you know that. Um, well, let's see, what items do we have? Flame Blade's kind of. Uh, I'll go with Vicious Shackle, how about that? Or Sackle, or. Sickle, Sickle, sickle. yeah, it's a Sickle. Uh, it's a yeah, I know. There's two of those in there now. Actually, now that I think about it, I can just. Uh, not quite. Not quite again. Um, did I hit them? How am I missing all of these attacks? Oh boy. Two holes. Oh, they're well, I'm um, alright. So they're throwing them. Oh, uh, that's not looking very good for me. They're just throwing them. Oh boy, alright. Um, take this guy out quickly. Oh, we do have some. And those guys are after me, aren't they? Oh boy, uh, not good stuff, you know. Definitely not good. See if that explosion can do anything. Nope. Doesn't seem like it. This is not looking very good on all my halves. <laughs> all right, uh, let's continue on. Take some of these arrows, I suppose. Well, I guess that like those guys uh, shoot the arrows. Take the archers out first is obviously a good idea. But how do I even get into the camp? This question. I could just like. Glide down, but gliding is kind of out of question at this point. Um, uh, oh, all right. Uh, you yeah. know, okay, okay. We I have. I think you have to like glide. We have a like sickle, it. so we're good. So I just stab him a few times in the groin with a sickle, and he's dead. I mean, evidently the most you know normal ways to kill something. You know, it's, it's like you have all you have all of a mortal plan that you just need to happen. Just take a vicious sickle and just stab them in like the groin, like one or two times. Sure to sure take out the haughtiest of foes. What's that shield now? Oh, that's childhood. Yeah, that's not one of the better ones. Um, go up here, see if there's anything around you. I'm sh I mean, maybe we just need to glide over. To yeah, I think yeah. we just need to glide over there from here. That was here my idea. Yeah, yeah. I think you're supposed to go over. Oh, there, there's another guy out there, an archer. You can just turn off. That was unnecessary. Oh shoot, I did not mean to do that. And oh. now we're almost dead. <laughs> Phrenic Bow! Bow passed down through the Sheikah tribe. Concentrating before drawing the swing will allow you to target di distant in. Okay. Alright, well, I will, I will evidently gonna be taking that over another one of these Boko Bows. Gonna quickly take that one. Uh, but I did want to get to the top here, so do need to eat quickly, see what good options we have. Uh, we are running out of those hardy truffles very, very quickly. Oh, I've seen someone take those. Yeah. Yeah. But, and I'm just wondering, where did I get that hardy truffle in the first place? Like, if it's so good, how did I get it in the first place? Because I want more of those! Well, uh, what's in here? Probably just a piece of opal. Yeah. Piece of opal. Okay. Always oh, like a piece of opal. Okay. That was just. Uh, that wasn't much, opal. but, uh. Can you, like. Some rupees, I suppose? Uh, Either way, we're just gonna make our way over here. Oh, wow, my sick was broken now. Well, it did a lot of damage to that. Of course it did. Um, wow, well, oh, yeah. uh, again, the guys with the bows aren't very good at close range stuff, so I can just take them out really quickly. The big thing right here is the blue guys. The blue guys are the big threats here, so that's why we're taking them out here. So, um, quick damage on those foes. I just fell off the quick, quick. Wait, are all of them dead? Or is just one on the ground? 
I'm confused now, but I thought I thought I like didn't kill one. Like I thought there's one that I didn't kill. But maybe I'm wrong. Who knows? Maybe that guy fell off the cliff and died. <laughs> that would be a lot of knockback. But I mean we've seen it before, so it's not out yeah, of the I question. Did, I did that too before. But like I don't know. Remember the one that like hmm. you finished like the snow area but like you like the one was like, you had to go up the bridge, but you didn't that at first. That was another flawless battle on yeah, all the Yeah, I house. killed like the blue guy. <laughs> the blue guy. Yeah, so we do want to make our ways over here if we do want to get to the head town village. Oh, it's the other way, I think. No, no, it's, it's said this way. Yeah. Yeah, I remember I had to go through the forest to get over here first. Again, there's so much that I want to explore, but the thing is, is that I know that this is where we're supposed to go in the game, and there's sure to be, you know, times I should look in places. Again, if there's anything that I really, really need to look at, you know, let me know if there's, like, some, you know, awesome thing. On. I'm just looking at the map for a second to you. I know that you guys can see it, because that's where my face cam is, but... Okay, but again, that's not where we're trying to go. We're trying to go to the Hateno village, not to uh, that port town, you know, so. I'll find your bike. I know where that is. Oh, those guys are fighting wild boars, isn't that nice? Yeah, fight that dude. Um, what are these? Okay, those are just random rock formations. Uh, but where is this going? It's not going to where we want to go, but actually, I did want to just check it out. I'm pretty sure... There's like, there's like connecting with where we initially uh, were going towards, right? Um, yeah, I just want to know if there's anything I missed while making no way. Um, oh, hey. Okay, alright. So we did miss something. So we do want to look over here. That is a moblin in the distance, I'm pretty sure. Uh, don't want to mess with that guy. I think you oh. Bees are dead? Well, there's like so many. How do bees like me? Okay. Uh, okay, so we went around there to appeal, but we missed this spot right here. Which, um, I, I, I actually like, I wanted to read the sign. What, what did the sign I'm say? I'm having like a bad feeling about this too. Um, equestrian riding course. Alright, well, let's, let's see what this equestrian riding horse has in store for us. It reminds me of a certain TV show. Um, alright. I did see a moblin, so I do want to be prepared. Yeah, that's a lot of moblins, yeah. That is a lot of moblins! You know, maybe I don't want to mess with this idea. Um, alright, um... <laughs> well, look at this! Look at this idea, everyone. Look at this. That's a lot of moblins, you know that? Um, well... Let's begin our slaughter, I suppose. Like, I know that multiple, you know, moblins and ones is not a good idea, but... We got a flame blade, so it's nothing to worry about. Uh, do some damage to them. There's just so many people dying at once, and... Did my flame blade... Yeah, what's happening? It doesn't have any flames now. Look at this. Wait, what? Seagull of the Mind's Eye? Yeah. That's like a shield, isn't it? Well, that... The thing about the flame shield blade is, like, it's a... Uh the same like the Master Sword, too. It's like the same thing as the Master Sword. The Master Sword blows up. Wait a second, wait a second. Are those... Oh, so those Traveler Shields are really good. So I do want those, actually. So, next time I see those, I gotta take those over the Boko Shields and all that jazz. Uh, wasn't really paying attention to the Shields and everything. But, uh... Let's continue our genocide, I suppose! Slaughtering every single thing that we see. I mean, to be fair, they are monsters. Oh, hey. They're attacking us first, but we're the ones that are hunting them down, and... Uh, that guy has a range advantage, but you know what? He's dead now. Almost. Now he's dead. I think you should, like, change it. Yeah, actually, no, I did no, want to no, see what no. these, uh, weapons are. Actually, drop the both of them, and then get yeah. that one. Serpentine Spear. So that does like half the damage of our flame blade, which is good. Um, okay. Uniquely Sheikah in design. Why are all these guys today having like Sheikah stuff? 
I don't know about you, but that's sort of weird to me. Just... Uh, what's going on here? It's like windy. Um, I, oh, there's a lot of blue guys over here. Spoke them a few times, and they're dead. That guy's almost dead. Now he's dead. Alright. Uh, <laughs> really not sure what to say. I mean, I'm just walking around, okay. slaughtering every single oh, person yeah. I see. That guy's a nice spear. I want that guy's spear. I'm gonna take that guy's spear after he dies. Oh, spear. spear. That's not very good. So then, why do I have it? <laughs> why does, like, I thought, that, like, it looks better than the one that I have, like, to you, but maybe that's just me being biased. I'm liking things that are worse. Oh, hey, more. that was like the one like with the old man's house again. Okay, that let's stab like the, the smoblin a few times. That looks like now the he's old dead. Man's house. That looks like the old man's Take his fangs, oh, I suppose, I and his guts. I think you didn't see well, something uh, after this. I think you didn't see something. Like that house. Oh, was your house? Yeah. I wasn't looking. I was just. I was just working on my genocide of killing every single monster that I come across. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's not over here. No, but there was like another moblin I think over here that I didn't get. Was there? Or am I going nuts? Okay, okay. Um, I'm actually gonna get my horse! But like, uh, there was one here. Yeah. Oh, that's a person. But if, I, if there's anything I've learned from last episode, not all of them are nice people, so hopefully this is a nice person. Want some information to you? Well, if you're being about horses, I'm a man. Horses get awful tired and running. You can't just dig and expose all the time these guys stay out of the Okay, at least his nice. So, how do I tell if they're healthy or not? What do you mean? Oh. Can I just, like, feed them or something? Feed what? Feed my horse. I'm sure there's a way to feed them. I'm gonna have to try that, you know, in a second. Um, see if I can, like, hold an apple or... Something like that, give it to him, and then he like likes me some more. Okay, um, what is he doing? <laughs> he just like went into the forest for no reason. But, oh, okay, I see what you meant by a house. Yeah, that's definitely yeah. a house. Yeah, I did want to check what's over here. I'm sure there's just like a moblin or something around here. Something like that? I don't see anything. Well, I'm gonna see something probably. I'm sure. Um, that's yeah. a door. I'm sure I could use that with my, you know, uh, magnesis, but I'm not sure what, you, what I'd use it for. But, well, um, then you're gonna find out. Oh, look, choo choo. We have to put the choo choo. I don't think it will be, though. Alright, um. Well, let's continue on and see what that house has in store for us, I suppose. Um. Wow, almost 20 minutes. This is nuts. But, uh, no one's at this house, but he does have a chest. Opal? No, it was okay. Both are fine with me. Both are fine with me. <laughs> we'll continue now, everyone. Um, well, yeah, that just seems to be a horse trail Opal, with some... Opal gives you loopies, loopies gives you arrows. Okay. So, I guess. Um, I don't think there's anything more, actually. I'm gonna... Do a quick loop to see if there's anything around. If not, I guess we're gonna continue our path to the Eternal Village. And I am lost a little hate. No, that's just apples, okay. I don't know Village is now. Confusing. What is that? Oh, I Those think like that's some... like a clock, actually. Is it? Yeah, I think. Huh. Just you check it out. Oh boy. Okay, okay. Now we're on the right path, everyone! Uh, to the Eternal Village. Mm. My horse! He doesn't like being still right now, but that makes sense. I mean, we're just getting to know each other. You know? Yeah. So. Oh, Don't really have to worry about this, Bacobans. Not powerful enough to stop me in my tracks with my horse. My trusty steed, Charcoal. Uh, yeah, go we actually do have a force coming up here. Um, I'm sure that... Oh, there is a shrine nearby. Well, that's... Actually, the Hayton Village, and there's a shrine right by it. Oh, okay, okay, that makes sense. I think that's what it is, actually. Yeah, because we are right next to the Hayton Village, so yeah, and I saw we might be correct. And if not, I'm sure that it's, you know, overlookable in, you know, by the village. But anyways, this is the Hayton Village, everyone! We made it! Alright. 
Um, I right. uh, actually quickly I just did did want to get a noble few shot of what uh, what this little force looked like. See if there was anything of note. Uh, do you have any any light blue? <laughs> If you catch my drift, uh, I know what that. Thing. Just saying, if you would go back to like the like um, like the uh other one, the um, what was it? The um, Kakaliko Village. If you go back there with that like red thing, I know how to deal with that. It's actually oh. a red shrine. Oh, it's a shrine. Yeah, you have to like make like a fail right in the hole. Yeah. Okay. I think. So. The Spring of Wisdom. Where do you want to recreate my journey? Okay. Oh yeah, this is the girl that has a fascination with Zelda. Who are you? Be on your way, you suspicious man. Hey. Ham. <laughs> I, I love the voice I'm giving to this man. You certainly do appear to be a Hylian like the rest of us. Hylians are generally good folks, so... Sorry for getting all worked up. You're free to go, just... We're just a waypoint in the widening road, huh? Ah, uh, the life of a traveler. Well, you can get most things you need at the general store, and the inn is just back there. Alright, so, that's a nice guy, I suppose. A little awful productive, but, you know, to be fair, with the Yiga dude is, like, trying to stab me, for no reason, makes sense, you know. So, this guy does have some trees he's planting. I can admire that, actually. It's the yoga clan guy. No, it's like the Yiga clan, not the yoga clan. <laughs> the yoga clan, everyone! The, the evil doers in this game. Yoga. The yoga clan. I call it yoga. Oh, okay. Um, I feel kind of mean for walking into this person's house. Oh. And now I'm standing on his table. I don't know how that... Is there anything? I I'm sure that, like, taking stuff is probably not a good idea, but... Uh, anything well, upstairs? It was just beds. Um, okay, Alright, well, we're good. Thing. We're good. We don't really need to go in anyone's house anyway, so... Not yet, I guess. Alright. How does it shine? I'm sure that there's just some, like, imaginary wind. That, that is something... Oh, what's this? Oops. Is it locked? Oh. It seems to be locked. Huh. That's interesting. Yeah. Is there actually anything in the house? That, there must have been something I missed. Is there something in the house where I can actually go inside that small little en enclave house thing? Not even an enclave, but you know what I mean. Um, no? It doesn't seem like it. Oh. Well, don't leave yet, probably. Yeah. yeah, I can't do anything with those. It's not like a hidden thing in the fireplace or nothing. Um... Alright, well, I'm fine with that. Just, just a little curious, you know, after, you know, venturing in Gekko, you go, oh. Um. Hey, there's private property here. Don't make me, um, claw someone. I'm sorry, that wasn't very nice of me at all. It's not a weirdo, I can tell. You're probably a great person to talk to. Oh, no, there I go again, just talking with no person. I get carried away and just don't know what it quit. Well, he drives my husband crazy when I can't find my point. I guess. You just go somewhere else, please. I'm sorry for speaking so harsh and didn't enjoy this apology. <laughs> huh. Well, talk about not being confident in your own abilities. I'm like, I, I, I just stole the two of her hicks, actually. One, like, directly from her and just one otherwise. Okay, can we actually walk in this door? I don't think that, no. Like the mobs and the heavy items again are just not, just not useful. Oh, I think you have to like put the chicken somewhere. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember like there's a thing in the Oh, there's a there. person right here tending to these crops. Is he going to be overproductive of them? Where are you looking to go? Oh. <laughs> a strange place. A very strange place and a place to rest. What does this have to... Okay. Um, Mr. Toothy? He is weird. Oh, I am a sage, but he's definitely a master of dying clothes. He's a master of wearing me out. A uh, very strange place. Um, a Tenno Ancient Tech Lab. Huh.
Alright. You're gonna have to watch out for that director. Place to rest? Well, of course. I had a feeling that I was just talking about the ends. The ends but. Huh. Looking for anything else? We're good. There's 25 right. minutes on there. Finally, someone who doesn't take up arms to all presents. Isn't that something? I think oh, well, that guy's singing. Chickens, yeah. Look at the travelers. This is the first time in Heat Tunnel Village. Well, you're in luck because you have a lifelong resident to show you around. Yes, please. Ah. Okay, let's hear your old fashioned dose of eternal hospitality. The shop is my daughter's kit is in my daughter's capable hands, he says, so I got a lot of time on my hands. That might be nice to do good and tour. Yeah, okay. Took me to show you the best place. Oh. So you're gonna show us around then? Alright. There's a general store, East Wind. They sell a lot of everyday goods and even some everyday greats. And now on with the tour. Alright. That's so we just like walked don't. into him. No, we're good. Um, this is a lot of people. So many people that I want to talk to, everyone. It's, it hurts. There's so many things. Oh, here, like... There's so many things. <sighs> There's a Kochi Dai shop known for the Hitano Dai. <laughs> the Dai. The Dai clothes, whatever color you like. And on with the duel. Oh, that, that actually sounds nice. Uh, I, I'm going to want to look into that. Um, Alright, um. Do you get on with the duel then? Um. That guy's running. <laughs> He's like straight up running everywhere he goes, so. Uh -huh. Very hospitable, I will say. <sighs> this here is Tan Puin. If you ever need to sleep overnight, this is the place. And now I'm with the tour. Oh, what's yeah. over here? I'm gonna show us something over here. No? Okay, I think that's where the shun is. No, that's some church. Um, Alright. What the. What does this guy Soden have to show us now? Like, so, um, Soden, not Soden. Soden, yeah, that's his name. Soden. Oh, this is like the clothes shop then? Oh, there's a clothing store, Vantist Clothing. They sell, well, I'm, I'm sure what you can you can guess what they sell. To be straight with you, this is actually my store, so come hang out when you've got some time. So I got forced before hiding to the coaching dye shop. Oh. Pretty much be, let's call this Sando too, yeah. Alright. Wow, alright, well that was something. Now I kinda know what's going on here. Which is nice. But I right, so this is a clothing clothing store? Uh, actually before we end off this episode, how about we take a gander at some of these clothes? Uh maybe get some dyeing. Oh yeah, you know? there's like enough of Dye a few of them, you know, see if we can do that and I don't know, we'll think that's, think that's good. Warm doodlet. Uh do I think I already have a warm doodlet. Yeah, you do. Warm jubilee. Yeah, I do have a warm jubilee. Uh, shorter sleeves. Yeah, that's worse than what I have right now. But that's soldier's armor. Okay, superior defense. Well, that's not very good because that's worse defense than what we have right here, but... I think it's quite um, good for look, though. Yeah, it does look nice, though. And so. what about that? Huh. Yeah, that's 250. That's a lot, I would say. Soldier's helmet. Oh. Again, all this stuff has like one less than what we have right here, you know. This mm -hmm. Hylian stuff seems to be very good. Mm -hmm. Well, goes, it's only good because we've upgraded it, so... Um... I don't know. I don't know. I think this outfit that we got right here is... Good. So, I mean... I guess... I guess, you know what? I, I guess I'll... Buy this stuff. You know, see... See if it's worth it. Okay, let's see here. Thank you for waiting. That'll be 180. Thanks for your, your business. Okay, die by the soldier's armor. Alright. I only have one of each. Oh, that's 200. Alright, well. I'm sure we can afford that a diff like, different time, you know. This definitely makes me feel better than what I was wearing, you know, earlier, so. I think I look nice, so <laughs> let's say that much at least. But yeah, uh, now, let, let, now let's uh, get some dyeing going on. Let's dye if you can. Not a dye, but you, 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 you see what I, you know what I mean. You know, let's, let's dye a few clothes. So. 
Uh, let's see, what does this lady look? Not lady is. Okay, that guy's creepy. <laughs> Alright, uh, welcome. If you're looking to add some color to your wardrobe, then you came to the right place. Okay, then we just want to close the buy. Okay. Alright, let's do it, even though this guy is crazy. This guy's actually freaking me out. His nose is stupidly long. Is <laughs> he like Pinocchio now? Okay. Man, that's a lot. Oh, wow. So like we can that. dye like any color that we want, actually. That's really nice. Huh. Pull I think I'm going to go with this light blue because, well, you guys can kind of imagine why. Because that's his channel. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So there is a reason for these choo choo jellies. Right. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, Link. Link looks very intimidated. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. What is going on here? Oh, man. Oh, boy. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. You know, we made something very special here. I just say, this would be like dashing and find it's palatable. Okay. I love this. This actually looks great. All right. Well, uh, let's see if he can do that to these clothing, essentially. Okay. Talk to this guy again. Like no Pigment of my imagination. I, I love what he is saying. It's just good stuff. Um, wow, I don't even know what was going on. He's treated like dunk dust underwater or the dye thing, I think. Um, but yeah, let's choose a color then. Uh, just this is the light blue. But, uh, do what? Let's see. Do what? No, I don't know. Maybe Helen. <laughs> Making us look like sheep to an extent. Yeah, let's see. Black? White. Where's bl black? Black is right here. There's no white. I don't think. I don't see huh. white. Oh. Yeah, see, the light blue looked nice on the other one, but not on this one, is the thing. So. Do white. Uh, white? Actually, yeah, that doesn't look too bad. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with white. Oh, okay. We're good. Um, black? Do we have any of that? No? Alright, um. Okay, go to. Okay, we'll just go back. Alright, choose again. Alright, what else do we have? This is like navy. I mean, that looks nice. Okay. Uh, so we do have like the light blue. Okay, so that's what these are for. Huh. I think you should get like a, like a, hmm, like. Alright. Um, I got be twenty rupees. Let's see how this looks. Let's see how this looks. Oh, thanks for the business. <laughs> okay, I know what happens here, but it's, it's just very comedical. I love it. I love it. Okay, so that will be a blue. This looks very nice, I will say. Looking very chic. <laughs> Alright, well, lovely one. I'm gonna... I actually did want to equip this outfit right here. I think it looks... Nice on us. Anyways, uh, with that, uh, everyone, I suppose uh, that's where this episode is going to have to end, sadly. Yeah, but, um, yeah, so I'm going to say, everyone, thank, thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed the video. Comment if you have anything to say. Share with your friends. And I'll see you next time on The Legend is on a Breath of the Wild. I'll see you then, everyone. Bye-bye.